So entrepreneurs are in every possible field. They're in teachers, they are in small businesses, they're in writers, authors, all of them are in different walks of life and different careers of life. But learning to think entrepreneurial means I'm learning to shift paradigms. I'm learning to invite others to shift paradigms. You notice every time I talk to you, I bump you around something, right? I'm always saying, no, you don't want to think about that way. Or you want to ask this kind of question. That's really what makes an entrepreneur is they are never accepting of what people are saying because that's what they always say. They are in the process of getting us to see the paradigm that we're in. So for me, it's getting people out of the extract value paradigm beyond the arrest disorder and doing less bad and particularly unstuck from the do good which has now become the popular phase. We're going beyond less bad and do good. Oh my God. What's true is the minute we do that, our human projections of what we think and our tribal projections and our ethnic projections and our whatever category you identify with, we impose on other people. You want people moving into a living systems paradigm. Entrepreneurs are always walking on the edge of being contrarian. I was called my, my grandfather when I was young, a positive contrarian. And what he meant by that was I questioned everything, but it wasn't because I was a cynic or even necessarily a skeptic. It was because I could see something that nobody was seeing yet. And I wanted to bump their worldview to see that. So my favorite question for entrepreneurs is what have I become incredibly satisfied with? And listen to yourself. What is it you, you're saying and selling over and over again? What are you trying to convince people of? And the second question I ask is, where is that showing up? Where can I see? Like, if I'm making presentations, do I use the same PowerPoint? If I'm telling stories, I'm working today to come up with whole new examples for you. If I find myself telling the same stories, I don't have an entrepreneurial mind and I'm not a part of helping us shift paradigms as I do that because I'm not working on shifting me. Can you learn to question even yourself and others? And how can you learn to do that? Because that's what's going to get us to the new paradigm.